Hi beautiful souls, it's Rachel here and I've just come on to answer your questions about the Angel Communication Program. We start on the 15th of February, which is as of today, one week away. So exactly one week, you could be sitting on Zoom and joining me for the first session. So I'm getting lots of emails and DMs, so I thought it'd be quicker to answer your questions on a video. So first up, one of the biggest questions is, is there a payment plan? I know it's a significant investment to do this program. In Australian do dollars, it's 1,997 Australian dollars, which translates to around 997 British pounds and 1400 US dollars. Now you'll have to do that conversion in Google if you come from another country, but those are the only two I could remember. So you get to pay for the program over six months if you choose. If you do that, the minute you sign up with your first deposit, which is 397 Australian dollars, that entitles you to show up for the whole program, right? So then you pay the rest off in the, in the following months. And you can set that up effortlessly on my brand new cart process, and it will automatically deduct it um, for you on the same day of the next few months, okay? So you can go and do that, it's effortless, it's easy, and I've made it as simple as possible. So that would work out about half of that, about 190 British pounds, maybe, um, I can't work it out in, in US dollars, but you'll have to do the Google thing. So you can do a payment plan, yes, or you can pay in full up front, save a little bit of that interest, and get the free private reading if you decide to pay up front. Lots of people decide to do that at last minute because they really want that private reading with me. And once you get that reading, you can book in for that any time between the beginning of the program and the end of March. After, in, in the beginning of April, I'm going away overseas for a couple of months. So um, I, I will be doing kind of a minimal amount of readings while I'm away. So I'd rather you get it done then. So the other question I'm getting, other than the payment plan and the costs and converting it into your currency, which is easy to do on Google, and don't forget that PayPal will convert it to your currency. So you don't have to send me Australian dollars. PayPal will do that automatically when you set up your payment. Will I run it again this year? I honestly can't tell you. I have no plans. I usually schedule these programs ahead of time, but because of the issues I've had getting overseas to see my family in the last two years, I'm gonna spend a good couple of months in the UK. When I get back is when I'll be rescheduling things for the rest of the year. So I'm not sure if I'm gonna run it again. To be honest, I probably will not. I've got another program that I intend to run towards the end of 2022. I've also got a couple of book launches coming up and some other little bits and pieces to share with you. So stay posted. So don't say, oh, I'll leave it until later in the year because um, I've got no plans to run it again. What cards do you need to bring to the program, right? A big part of this program is learning to read the Oracle cards in a way that allows you to receive angel messages to intuitively tune in. And these are the cards that I recommend, the Angel Power to Row deck. Now, you don't have to use these cards. There's no rules. If you want to get them, um, that's good because you know it helps me to help you translate them a little bit as we work with them but any cards that you have that have detailed pictures on them not not abstract pictures abstract pictures don't work as well in the style that I do reading so anything that has pictures that are quite detailed with symbols and images on them that's really useful so you can bring along the angel cards that you already have any other deck by this author, Radley Valentine, is also useful. Any of his um, angel tarot decks. Now, I'm not reading them from the perspective of tarot. I'm reading them intuitively as I'll teach you in the program. So this isn't a tarot learning course. You'll learn a lot about the cards and how to use them. And you'll be able to use them even if you don't fully understand the, the tarot. Whole, that's a whole system in its own right. You'll get little insights, but not the whole thing. All right, will you be able to attend um, set all the sessions? You know, if you're overseas, if the time zone isn't right, will it matter if you can't attend all the sessions or any of the sessions? And I say no. Now, the reason is you can come to sessions that you can make it to, 
but I do a recording, a replay, an audio replay, a video replay. You get the slides, the presentation and the class notes and any other content that is part of that particular lesson will be placed for you on my brand new membership platform where you can access your course. So if you miss a session or two or three and you want to catch it on the replay, you can do that. And I post those between five and 24 hours after the event. Sometimes it takes longer to upload. So I'll go to bed and do it in the morning, right? But most of the time you can access that a few hours after the live event. So you can do the entire course as a replay if you want, and then ask me questions to answer in the lives. I can answer your questions on our um, very interactive, uh, community page, which is private. No one else on Facebook knows that you're there or what you're saying, except for people in the group and me. So you can approach me um, and ask questions through that page. You can post images of readings that you've done or ask me questions about some sign that you've had, and I'll be able to give you feedback, guidance, mentoring in that page. So we can still have our live interaction and everything else. So if you do have to miss a session, don't worry about it, you will get those replays. And it's totally up to you if you want to do it and you think, right, I'm not gonna be there for the lives, but I wanna do the whole program as a replay. Talk to me about that, send me a message and I will answer any questions that you have. Many people do do that. I have a lot of American, US and, and Canadian um, students who have done it that way. So it's not a barrier if you don't want it to be. Session times, okay. I'm in Australia and I'm on Sydney, um, New South Wales, Australia time. So we meet at 7 p.m. New South Wales time on a Tuesday evening for six Tuesdays. We also meet on two Thursdays. So that's Thursday the 24th of February and Thursday the 10th of March for a healing session. And for the healing sessions, they're not as interactive as in you don't have to be plugged in and, and um, taking notes or practicing. This is like going to be like a guided meditation or a healing where I'm working on your energy. I do work on you personally and as a group. So that's why I keep my groups small in this program. So you need to check those in your time zone. So roughly 7 p.m. Sydney, Australia time is around eight or nine in the morning for the UK and Europe. And in the US and Canada, it's late at night the night before or in the early hours of the morning. You need to Google that. All of that is on my information page. You can have a look. As I said, replays are there as well. So we meet weekly and those weekly sessions aren't overwhelming. I'm not going to bombard you with information. I'm not going to send you piles of stuff and tell you you have to read it. Most of it happens in the sessions. I'll give you little, short, simple practices that will enhance opening your intuitive channels that will strengthen that bond with the angels. But they're gonna be things that you enjoy doing and aren't gonna take up heaps of your time and you can continue using them beyond. And of course, nothing is mandatory. I'm not checking homework or there's no tests in this. This is about you engaging with this energy, with this knowledge, wisdom, and you're practicing in the sessions mostly so that you are developing these, these gifts and this knowledge. So not loads of homework, not overwhelming. What happens if you turn up late? Someone asked me that the other day. Look, if you are putting your kids to bed and you just, you know, or something's going on and you don't make it straight, you know, on time to a session, please do your best to. But if you don't, it doesn't matter because I always make sure that the setup is that no one can tell if you're turning up late. There's no ding, there's no message that goes off. Um, if you come in five minutes, 10 minutes, half an hour late, or you have to leave to tend to something, you can have your camera on or off during the sessions. It's totally up to you. I know what it's like to be new in a group and to be like, oh, it's scary. So you can keep that camera off for a while if you want. There are times sometimes where I might ask you, put your cameras on and show me the card that you've just pulled. Or put your cameras on for a moment so that we can we can have a, a, you know, a discussion about something. But it's no big deal. And again, I'm not strict on this, like, but it's nice, right, to connect with the other like-minded people in the group. I'm very good at bringing together groups who are 
loving, kind, warm. There's no big egos. There's no competition. It's not stressful because none of us can operate under that kind of pressure, right? I know I can't. So I'm good at attracting those kind of people. And, and I have to tell you so far, we have got such a beautiful group and I'm really excited about everyone who is there. I always am because it's a beautiful energy. And that's another lovely thing about the program is that you get to meet like mine. Sometimes being spiritual, starting your spiritual journey or being on a spiritual journey, having recently awakened, it's hard to find people to talk to about this stuff. It's hard to find people that you trust enough to not go roll their eyes or think you're a weirdo. In my groups, we are all on the same path. We all understand. You don't have to say, sorry if this sounds weird, <laughs> because we get it. You know, so many people have joined because they got a sign. So many people have joined because they just felt inexplicably drawn. They had a dream that they were on the program. Happens more often than not. Yesterday, during a discovery call, um, someone got a sign during the call, which gave them the confirmation that they should do it and they could afford it. So don't be surprised if those signs come and please don't push them away. I know that sometimes it's nerve wracking. You worry about spending the money, maybe wasting it on a program like this. You won't waste it because this isn't information that you will just end up, you know, in the in the spam folder or never being opened again. I promise you, you will enjoy the program. You'll enjoy what you get out of it and you can dip in and out of it um, for a lifetime, for as long as the program is available on my website, you can, you can access it and you can even download some of the um, materials and keep them on your own computer. So you can go back and do short meditations that I've recorded, especially for the program. You can go over lessons again. You can, you'll get check sheets, which allow you to quickly figure out, okay, how, how do I do this particular style of reading? What things do I rem have to remember to say before I do a reading? How should I protect my energy? You'll have those in easy to access kind of check worksheets, single sheets, so that you can access them quickly and go back to them. So it's not going to go to waste. And what you will learn will give you the lifelong skills and knowledge to continue your journey. So it's not something that's ever going to be wasted. All right, so camera's off. All right, someone else asked me, do I have to be especially gifted? to do this program and absolutely not, you don't. Part of the reason for doing it is because you feel drawn to learn what I have to offer, opening your intuitive channels, creating a strong connection with your angels, getting answers from the angels about your life purpose, your next steps in the decisions that you need to make, um, what you're going to do next after the program ends, you know, anything. So you are learning as you go this isn't something that you come to already finished you know those people um aren't attracted to this kind of work because they've already done it so you are coming to do to learn more to awaken and advance your gifts and that means that i deliver that in a simple easy to understand grounded supportive way and I guide you step by step through it. So it's not going to be highfalutin jargon, stuff that you don't understand. You will understand it because I have been in your shoes and I love to be able to translate this kind of information in a way that people get it quickly and easily and that they understand it and can practice. And what you don't, doesn't align with you, it doesn't matter because we've all got different gifts that come in different ways. And I'll explain more about that in the program. So no, you don't have to be especially gifted. And if you have fears going into this, that's normal too. Feeling anxious, feeling blocked, feeling like you're not psychic enough, feeling like you, you just simply can't do it. And, and you know, perhaps everyone else can, and you can't, that's normal to feel that way. Absolutely. And it's also, part of it because the reason we do this kind of training and these kind of this kind of work is because we don't get this kind of information off Google. We can't get this easily. This is information that you need to learn. We all kind of think 
people are born psychic and intuitive and they have these special gifts and yeah there's people that lean more towards that just like there are people that are more creative or people that are more mechanical or people who are into academics but everyone has to learn the steps the insights there are things that you don't know yet which will enable you to open up those to those areas that you don't already know so don't think that you have to that you know psychics are just born and then they don't ever go to a class to learn anything that's very rare if it does happen and it's not true and any of the famous psychic and intuitive or angel mediums people that communicate with with their souls and spirit and their higher self they've all gone to some kind of formal training and that has been the pivot point where they have been able to go on and develop those gifts and discover their purpose whatever that may be right i have people in my program who are authors who are setting up businesses to help people in ways that doesn't advertise that don't advertise that they have intuitive skills but they need they use those intuitive and angelic and healing skills to help themselves and to help their customers or their client base whatever it may be so it's how it all opens up for you so don't be worried about that fear is fear and that's what we're dealing with in the program that's why we've got two healing sessions and i will teach you how to overcome those fears how to clear them how to release them and i think that is just about it so if you have any other questions about the program and how it works what you'll get from it what the bonuses are and anything else that comes to your mind please get in touch send me a dm or an email or we can set up a 15 minute zoom or telephone call and we can i can answer your questions there is no hard sales with me what i find is most people have a feeling and they feel drawn to it for me there's no point in saying in hard selling to someone and then they they you know it doesn't feel right for them people are attracted to this program for the right reasons if you feel drawn to it and you might not even know why you're drawn to it trust that that's how i started i had no idea why i was drawn to do uh, a uh, an angel and psychic development program in 2003 i think and it led me to all of this so trust that you there is something in this for you all right angel blessings i will see you soon we start next tuesday the 15th of february at 7 p.m sydney australia time you've still got time to book in take care